Scattered throughout the jungles of southern Mexico lies one of history's greatest enigmas. 17 massive stone heads, some towering up to 11 feet and weighing as much as 40 tons. These sculptures were carved over 3,000 years ago with basalt, a rock that is found over 90 miles from where the heads were discovered. How were these immense stones transported through rugged terrain with no advanced technology? Why were they created and what do they represent? The Olmec civilization existed from 12,000 BCE to 400 BCE and are known to be responsible for these massive figures. Despite lacking metal tools, the artisans achieved an impressive level of precision. They were likely sculpted using hard, hand-held rocks, and it is speculated they were originally painted using bright colors. Each stone is uniquely and intricately carved with striking facial features and are adorned with headdresses or helmets that were worn by the Olmec people in battle. It was a widely held belief in Mesoamerican culture that the head alone contained the emotions, experience and soul of an individual, which may explain why the sculptures only depict the head. Scholars have long debated whether these sculptures were symbolic of power or if they played a role in ancient rituals as they are said to have been thrones or altars that were often moved by the Olmec people for ritualistic purposes. Equally perplexing is the question of how these massive boulders were moved over 90 miles from the Tuxtla Mountains to their final resting places at sites like San Lorenzo and La Venta. The coordination and manpower required to move such heavy stones through rivers and across dense forests imply an advanced level of planning and engineering far beyond what was previously believed possible for an ancient society. Some suggest that wooden logs and large blast river rafts were used for the transport. Once the stones reached their destinations, they were intricately shaped into the detailed portraits that vary in pattern and design. Mysteriously, some of these heads appear to be deliberately defaced and buried sometime before 900 BCE, perhaps to mark the end of a ruler's reign. However, the reasons behind their burial is as elusive as the disappearance of the Olmec civilization itself. With no definitive answers, the questions surrounding these towering sculptures remain some of the greatest unsolved mysteries in archaeology.